Hey guys, so I'm back with another haul. Um, I just did my book haul, and it's mainly books that was ordered through Amazon, and I told you guys that I also ordered movies through Amazon as well. Um, so this is going to be the movie portion of my haul, and <laughs> let me just get this out in the air that I buy a lot of movies. Um, a lot, because <laughs> I, don't, I don't really watch TV. So, uh, there's only, like, very few shows that I watched. So, I do watch a lot of movies, and I have the vast majority of movies in my collection. So, I do buy quite a few, but I don't buy movies at full price. I go to pawn shops. Um, I look into the $5 bins at Walmart. That's where I get most of my movies is the $5 bins. Um, and I order off Amazon. And when I say that Amazon's DVDs are cheap, I mean they're cheap. And not cheap quality, but like cheap prices. And they're not used, they're, the DVDs that I got from Amazon are unopened. They're still in the little plastic wrap thingy. So, I figured I would do a haul and talk about them and I have my prices and everything. So first I'm going to start off with movies that I got from Walmart. Um... So yeah, and most of these movies were picked out, some of them were picked out by my boyfriend, so I will let you guys know. Um, the first one, I don't have the case for, I'm pretty sure it's at my dad's, I took it home one time when I went back to visit him, um, I want to say over my spring break, which was in March, and I had my DVD case with me, and I, for some reason, put this in there, and, like, my big case for all my DVDs, and I forgot to get my actual case, so yeah. And that is Matilda. I love Matilda. I think it's a fabulous movie. So I bought it. I think I'm pretty positive that was in the $5 bin at Walmart. Actually, all of these but two were in the $5 bin. And I'll do the two that weren't in the $5 bin the last. So yeah. Um, the first one I got is act was actually when I was picked out by my boyfriend. And it's just go with it. It has Adam Sandler and Jennifer Aniston. Yeah. Um, and it and this was like this was a good movie. Um I thought it was funny. I have seen it before, um, so I knew what it was about and my boyfriend had never seen it before, so I I thought it was good. Um, he picked it out, so <laughs> not my choice, but I, I think it's good. I mean, it's well worth putting in the DVD collection, I think. So, yeah. Second one, we both picked out, and I actually really, really like this movie. And that is Friends with Benefits with Justin Timberlake and Mila Kunis. Kunis? Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. She's gorgeous, by the way. A whole time I'm, like, covering my boyfriend's ass because I don't want him to look at her because she's so pretty. Um, so, yeah. This was this is a fantastic movie, and I got this from the five dollar bin. And I suggest anybody go pick this up from Walmart from the five dollar bin. And it's just a really funny and really good movie. Um, next one is I love this actor slash director. I want to buy all of his movies, and I plan on it. And that is Madea. Um, I got Medea's Big Happy Family. I absolutely adore Medea. She, he, it's very funny. And I just crack up every time I watch these. These are the type of movies that I could watch over and over again and be fine with it. There are some movies, like the Just Go With It movie, that I'll watch once. And, you know, it's, it's a good movie, but I don't particularly want to watch it again for a while. Like, I want the what happened like the memory of the movie to fade away so I don't remember what happens in the movie basically in order to watch it again but Medea movies I would watch over and over and over again it's just hilarious um next one I got is Mean Girls and I was very ecstatic to have this in my collection um this along with the previous movies I've shown you and the next three I'm going to show you are all from the $5 bin. And I'm very ecstatic to have this in my collection. I love this movie. And when I saw it in the $5 bin, I was like, oh, I'm getting it. So I bought it. Um, classic movie. I made my boyfriend watch it. He thought it was funny. <laughs> so it's a plus. The next one, I actually want this book more than anything, but it's so expensive. It's like $15. So hopefully I get it for my birthday. And that is The Time Traveler's Wife. 
I love, 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 love this movie. It is fantastic, and it actually has um, my favorite actress in it, which is Rachel McAdams. So yeah, I love it. The next one I got, um, my boyfriend actually picked out, and that is Bad Teacher. And it has Cameron Diaz and Justin Timberlake in it, and Jason Segel. Um, this is a really funny movie. I think that anybody that has a Walmart near should go pick this up from the back of the bin. Yeah, that was funny. It's very fantastic. Um, and the last one that I got from the bottle I've been is Beastly. And I actually want to get this book as well. And it has, um, Vanessa Hudgens. It has Mary-Kate, uh, Olsen in it. And then Alex Pettifer. Pettifer? Pettifer. Pettifer. Alex Pettifer. And this is just a fantastic movie. I want to get the book for this. Um, I just, it's a good movie. But this is also one of those movies that, I get bored with because I've seen it before, so I kind of get bored halfway through. But it is a fantastic movie. It's just I, there's some movies I don't like watching over and over again. But I really wanted it. Now the next two, I bought at Walmart, but not from the five dollar bin. The first one I actually bought online when I bought um, a book that is in my book haul called Weather. Um, I actually bought this with it, and it was only, it was less than five bucks. It was like four sixty something, and that is another Medea movie. And this is my actual, actually my favorite Medea movie um, that he, the director, she, the actress, has made. Um, I'm just going to refer to Medea, or Tyler Perry, who plays Medea, as he. But um, this is my favorite movie he's made, and it's Diary of a Mad Black Woman. Hilarious movie, like, super funny. Um, only four bucks, five bucks on Walmart.com, so you should check it out. And then the next one... I honestly don't know how much I paid for this. I feel like, yeah, I remember now. I got this from a pawn shop back home. Um, this pawn shop back home, brand new movies, literally brand new movies, and um, they have a sale. It's ten for twenty, so you get ten t ten DVDs for twenty dollars, and people will bring their brand new movies in and just sell them. So you have very good movies, and I want this book too. And I actually got the New Line Platinum series, and it's like. Like a two disc, oh, I didn't know that. It's a two disc, I know it was two disc, but first disc is widescreen, second disc is full screen, that's what I didn't know. But it's the, um, the notebook, and Rachel McAdams, my favorite actress, is in it, and Ryan Gosling, I think. Yeah, Ryan Gosling, I couldn't remember his last name. He's in it. First off, he has gorgeous abs. Second off, this is a fantastic movie. I made my boyfriend watch it with me, and he even likes it. Um, I just love this movie, and I want the book so bad, along with, uh, Time Traveler's Wife. Now, the rest of the movies are movies that I got with my Amazon order, along with my books, um, and I have the prices with me. So, the first one, I wanted more than anything, and I'm pretty sure other, this is the second most expensive DVD that I bought. And, you know what, I'm fine with it, because I actually was going to buy this on Walmart.com when I bought the Medea movie, and it was like 11 bucks on Walmart.com, and I found it on Amazon for $8.63, and that is Midnight in Paris, and it has Owen Wilson, Rachel McAdams, and then, oh, what's her name, the, um, the lady off the of Titanic, I don't know if you can see her picture, but she plays the really nice rich lady on Titanic. Um, that helps, uh, Jack with his suit and stuff like that. Um, I think, I feel like her name's Carla Bruni, maybe? I don't know. But, I have wanted this movie, and if you can't tell from both my poster and my necklace, I love Paris and my blanket, but it's kind of covered up. Um, but I love Paris. I love everything about Paris, and I planned on going to Paris for my graduation present, because I graduate in May. Of 2014 or this coming May and I planned uh you know my parents and I planned on me going to Paris for graduation but I think plans have changed um I think I'm going to Greece uh for my graduation presents so yeah maybe I can make my way over to Paris while I'm there um so yeah I by the way I'm not spoiled whatsoever I have to pay for half the trip but I've worked very hard for my degree and my parents both agree and I paid for all of college myself so you know 
a trip to Greece has been well deserved. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, by the way, if you didn't notice, no, I'm getting my Bachelor of Science in Psychology with a minor in Communications. So, it's a science degree. And I'm proud to say that my professor told me that when we graduate, we can officially call ourselves scientists. So, <laughs> my degree was very well earned and so will this trip to Greece. So, yeah. Um... I got this mainly because it's in Paris. I know that sounds bad. And Rachel McAdams is in it. And like I said, she's my favorite actress. But it shows a lot of the sights of Paris. And if you want a review on any of these movies, please do ask. Because I will give them to you. Um, but I bought it mainly for the fact that it's in Paris. And they show the sights of Paris. So, But I did watch the trailer for it. And it looks fantastic. So yeah, I'll let you guys know. Second one I bought is a classic. And I wanted it so bad. And it is The Breakfast Club. And this is actually the flash flashback edition, and it comes with a little thingy for it. And all of these are in the little plastic inside. Well, this one's inside, but so they're brand new. Um, I paid four ninety nine for this on Amazon, so I'm very excited for this. Um, my boyfriend's never watched this, so he'll be watching it soon. Um, the next one was actually my most expensive purchase through my Amazon order, and it was $13.41, which is fine because there's two DVDs in here, and I have one of these DVDs for as long as I can remember, and I watch these all the time when I was younger, and I just love them, and a lot of people are probably going to make fun of me, but you know what, it's okay, I don't care, judge me all you want, and they are the Halloween top movies, and if you remember, these played on Disney Channel. And I've looked everywhere for these, and I can only find them sold in the two packs, the Halloween Town and Halloween Town 2, which is fine. Um, I watched this for a while, and it fluctuated between, like, 11 bucks and 15 bucks, and finally, when I purchased it, it was thirteen forty one, which I'm fine with, because it's two DVDs for $13. So, I was very excited. I've always wanted to own these. Um, they're just, they remind me of my childhood. They came out in, I want to say in the 90s, but I'm pretty sure. Maybe they came out. The DVD release was in 2005, but I feel like... I feel like this came out... Early. I don't remember when they came out, and it doesn't really say. But, um, the DVD release was in 2005. And I've always wanted to own these. I try to find them online, like to watch online, and I can't. So I finally purchased it. Um, I'm very... This was the one thing that I was most excited for in the package. So I'm excited. And then I got Halloween Town High, which is the third movie for it. And this was, uh, this is 2005 release as well. I can't find the years for these, but they were on Disney Channel. And I'm so excited. Um, this is Halloween Town High. And I want to get the last one. And I plan on getting it. It's, although it's a change of actress, um, I liked Kimberly Brown as Marnie in this movie, or in both of all three of those movies. I liked Kimberly Brown, and then they changed to Sarah Paxton. I, I guess Marnie or Kimberly Brown didn't want to come back um, to play her. I think her last name's Brown. Yeah, Kimberly Brown. Um, but I want to get it. It's ten bucks, so I'll probably be getting it sometime this month. I know. With for my birthday, I plan on getting it because I'll probably get an Amazon gift card. But I plan on getting it, and I'm so excited because then I'll complete the whole series, and that's been a dream of mine because I just love that series. So yeah, last or not last, one of the um, one movie I got was Beetlejuice, and actually, oh, Halloween Town High was five seventy one. I got Beetlejuice, um, and I paid. $3.99. Yeah, $3.99 for this, and I'm very excited because I've always wanted to own Beetlejuice. This is a 20th anniversary deluxe edition, and I've always wanted to own this. I've thought of every year when this comes on, I TiVo it on my mom's TV and record it, so because I love it. I have 30 more seconds. Um, Last movie that I bought was Real Women Have Curves, and I paid $5.98 for this. Um, this is a fantastic movie. If you can get your hands on this, this is extremely well extremely fantastic movie it has America Ferreira and George Lopez in it and it is a very good movie it talks about how bigger women overcome that so yeah oh my gosh five more seconds um I got the 30 day shred by Julian Michaels plan on losing weight hey girl all right so comment if you want any reviews on anything and thanks for subscribing yeah bye